Welcome to another edition of Tesla Tips and Trips. And on this episode, we are going to test how long it takes to charge a 2022 Tesla Model Y performance from 5% all the way up to like 65 or 70 percent kind of simulating what it would be like on a road trip and we're trying to get into a l3 250 kilowatt supercharger right now we're still in line waiting keep it here on tesla tips and trips All right, we have gotten a stall on a uh, V3 supercharger, 250 kilowatts. We just got the uh, battery warning, battery very low. We are at 5% state of charge. And that on a Tesla Model Y performance is 15 miles. So let's plug in, ramp up. It has been preconditioning for about an hour now. So the battery should be sufficiently warm. And let's see exactly how, how long it takes to go from 15 miles of charge or 5% state of charge, up to about 65 to 70. All right, we're gonna supercharge. I gotta do the dance with the shirt. Sweet. All right, we're plugged in. Let's go check it out. All right, we're ramping up. Wow, we are going super fast. Look at that. It is ramping up. 165 is what we're topped out at. 166. Interesting, we didn't get over 200. No, because remember it's 11 percent or whatever until it. Oh, that's right. So we should check this out. So we're at six percent now. Marcus makes a good point. It doesn't really start ramping up until about 11 percent, although it's already doing it. So maybe on a on a Model Y performance, yeah. Now we're hitting way over 200. 225. 230. Are we going to see max? 241, two, three, four, five. Come on, let's go 250, let's max it out. Will we do it? 48, 49. Oh, come on, 50, yeah. we did it. Yeah. We maxed it out, we're at 250. So we know this test is gonna be legit. The battery is sufficiently warm. And uh, now let's see exactly how long it takes. We're at 1030 exactly on the watch or the clock there. And uh, we are now at 9% just talking about that. So uh, let's see exactly how long it takes to go from 5%, um, and I'm gonna say 65%. Let's do that. Just an observation while we're here. Um, the map says five. The nav says five stalls available. Um, guys, I count a lot more than that. I mean, there's one, two, three, four, five, six. There's one leaving here. There's seven, eight, nine, there's 10 on the other side. I mean, I'm not sure what the nav is thinking, but uh, don't always believe the nav when you're on a road trip. Uh, if it says there's, you know, not as many as you think and you arrive and all of a sudden there's plenty. So, uh, and sometimes there's not, but in this case, there's a lot more than five available. So I'm not sure what's going on with the, uh, the Tesla counter thing. All right, here we are. We're at 25% uh, already. We're just three minutes into the session, maybe four. I think it, we started technically around 10.29. We are at 25% state of charge already, 26 going up as we speak, and we're still at 195 kilowatts. So I have a feeling this session is gonna be a lot faster than the video you might've seen for our Tesla Model 3 SR Plus, which took, I believe the number was 16 minutes from 5% to 65%. So uh, there we go, we're already up to 27. So there's a little update mid-charge. By the way, zero dollars. Thanks to those that uh, used our referral code before the, the that program ended. And we got uh, something like 4,000 supercharger miles and they don't expire until October. So we're gonna use those. Thank you very much. Time for a little update here. We're at uh, 40%, which on this car is 118 miles. So. And we're at 135 kilowatts. So just a little update and the time is 1038. So about eight or nine minutes into the uh, session. And uh, I wanna click this. We haven't really addressed this in a while. Those uh, that are new to Tesla's, uh, there's a little supercharging tips link on the battery page. And let's just run down those real quick. Uh, Find the fastest supercharger, filter by three bolts in the navigation. That's uh, interesting. Navigate to the supercharger. Battery will precondition for faster charging. We uh, 
discover that on the last two videos. Arrive with 20% battery or less, that is key. I know those that may have range anxiety think, oh, that's, that's freak out territory, but uh, it's okay. It'll be all right. You can do it. We did it here today uh, at 5%. Uh, leave space between cars. Neighboring stalls may share power, and it's the key word there is may, and we did a whole video on what that means. It really only affects uh, V2 superchargers. Uh, the Urbans are not affected, and the uh, the V3 250 kilowatt are not affected. You can you can have neighbors there. It'll be all right. They're not sharing is what the whole point of that is. And then, of course, move your car after charging because um, if they're busy, like most superchargers are these days, Tesla will start charging you idle fees, and they are pretty steep. So you don't want that. So there you go. Those are the supercharging tips under the uh, little link here on the uh, battery page. We'll catch you back here at 50%. Okay, we are now at 50% state of charge, 1042 in the morning. So about 12 minutes in, we're at 50% state of charge uh, or 148 miles. And uh, we're uh, tapering down now. We're at 108 kilowatts. Um, I believe the battery was as warm as we could make it. It was preconditioning for about an hour, driving around town doing the uh, supercharger, uh, I'm sorry, the Tesla spotting game. Um, but at the moment, we are four minutes away from taking longer than our SR Plus. Now, I get it, that battery's a lot smaller. So I just kind of wanted to compare the two though. So we'll catch you back here at 65%. That's our uh, goal for today. And there it is, 65% at 10.49, 10.50, it just flipped over at the same time. So the answer is 20 minutes. It takes 20 minutes to go from 5% to 65% on our Tesla Model Y performance from 2022, exactly to the minute. Very cool stat, I love that. So now it's an easy answer for anybody that asks, how long does it take to charge your Tesla? I don't know if they sound that way or not. But now you have an answer and it's an easy answer, 20 minutes. Let's go unplug. All right, there you go. You've got your answer. How long does it take to supercharge on a fairly warm battery uh, our Tesla Model Y performance with 303 miles of rated range um, so if you're on a road trip, you can expect that if you get a V3 supercharger. Now V2, it's a whole other ball game. Maybe we'll do a different video on that. But uh, I think we had optimum conditions because it supercharged or it uh, preconditioned for about an hour um, and it got to peak speeds at 250 kilowatts. So that tells me the conditions were right. So uh, again, thank you so much for watching another edition of Tesla Tips and Trips. Of course, like, subscribe, hit the bell, and do all that fun YouTube stuff. And we will catch you on the next video.